think I got one up here. Oh yeah. Today we're fishing another one of my favorite spots out here at the Texas coast. We're gonna be chasing redfish and trout. There's a marsh system nearby and there's also a bay. So we have a lot of area to target. We'll be throwing artificial, most likely a paddle tail. And let's see what kind of damage we can do. There was silence on the water this morning, but it was quickly broken and it was music to my ears. That was a big red. There he is. Calm down. Boy, I just saw this guy bust and got right on him. That was pretty awesome. Let's see if, if we can get on something a little bigger. As we inched along the shoreline, we continued looking for any type of activity. And as the muddy bottom turned to grass, my hopes grew. It felt like the perfect spot. And then it happened. Might be a better one. Get out from under there. Oh yeah, that's a good one. That is a good one. That's a good one. Oh yeah, that's got some weight on it. Hot damn, hot damn. That's a little more like it. <laughs> Let's see if we can get on some more. As we reached the back of the bay, I noticed it was being fed by a creek inlet. It acted as a funnel, bringing in bait fish and shrimp. And it wasn't long before STX Outdoors noticed the small school taking advantage of it. See him right there, look towards that PVC pole. Yeah, that's a good one. I think the tails, yeah, I see him. This little flat area is pretty solid. You found them, you should get the, you should get the first dib. All right, let's see if I can reach. Oh yeah, I see him. I literally drug it over his back. Yep. Got it right there. <laughs> Hot damn, thanks to you, brother. Of course, it's the little one, but I take it. Beautiful, beautiful golden color. 
STX Outdoors puts you on the fish too, boy. All right, nice little guy. Put him back, let's get on some more. Then something in the distance caught my eye, but it was different from the others. So I paddled forward to get a closer look. I think I got one up here. Oh yeah. <laughs> that one might be a little better. Oh yeah, he's better. I saw the tail on this guy. Just take it nice and easy with him. That's what you like to hear out here. Oh, that's a nice one. That's a real good one. That's real good. He's thick. <laughs> He's nice and thick. Wait till you see what <laughs> I saw some huge tails and I was like, that's it right there. He wasn't getting off neither. Oh. And now that's a proper redfish. Hours and hours of searching and then you find it finally pays off. Patience really pays off sometimes. You gotta love it. All right, we're gonna let this guy go. Well, it's getting blazing hot and it's time to head back to Austin. It just goes to show, even as a weekend angler, you can still get on fish. All you gotta do is be patient. Look for tails, look for movement, that's all. If you're wanting more redfish action, this video right here will take you to the right place. Thank you for watching and we hope to see you out on the water.